right, uh, so in this case of Dead Miss It, we're, we're just going to be going to the crystal dimension and, use, and working with some crystal programmers to make the sec, the sec of Pisces around Giza. And then we're going to program it with all the uh, high intentions for the 5D consciousness, like the divine feminine, masculine balance, and DNA activations and all that kind of stuff. And then once we're done programming it, all that energy is going to shoot up Giza, go through all the grids. And um, so we're just getting into a meditative state, bring down source light over everybody. High rays. High rays of light coming down and shielding over all. And I'm just going to set the intention. I'm going to create pillars of light on all corners of everybody's house going in from Gaia all the way up to source. You can remove them when we're done. And then it's just going to create barriers of protection. And that's all us on our whole journey, shielded by blue energy. So it's anchored in a Gaia all the way up to the source. And we'll um, breathe in golden light through a crown chakra, sending it through all of our chakras out of our root, going into the center of Gaia, anchoring into the heart of Gaia, connecting our hearts with Gaia, bringing in the green energy from Gaia through our chakras, breathing through. Going out our crown chakra, connecting our pillars of light to source. Connect our hearts to the divine hearts, divine heart at source level. Okay, and then we'll call in the dragon collective to assist. Um, if you don't have a dragon, they'll just appear beside you. And um, there could be or orange and blue ones I've already seen. Orange and blue, those are two colors you don't see that. Um, and um, call in uh, all the high vibrational teams. Um, let's see who wants to be called in here. The uh, Dramanans want to be called in. I'm sure Phil's calling them in too. The Arcturians want to be called in. The Assyrians, the Larians. Yeah, Assyrians, Larians. Palladians. Palladians, Vagans. Um, Venetians wanted to come. That's who wanted to come. The Venetians. Okay. Orion. All, all the higher vibrational ones. Yes. The archangels, angelic collectives of that are in the angelic kingdoms, heaven, heaven, Father, Mother, God. El say, call in the divine that are at our frequency and higher thank you I'm at our frequency or higher thank you Some good energy. Uh, merlin merlin's father the divine goddesses which divine goddesses, the divine American goddesses priestesses. The east north south and west the original oh, the original 12 goddesses yeah, the Lemurian ones you call them there, so that's good. Divine feminine source, divine masculine source, the ascended masters, higher self. And anybody wants to call on anybody else before we head in here? Uh, just uh, all the old, as all the aspects that are of high vibration. Okay, throwing golden bubble shields over everybody who doesn't know how to make the shield, who just wants extra protection. We're watching the replay, watching now, bringing down 12 dimensional light language codes of protection from angelic source level. Okay. So we're going to get ready to, um, there it is. <clears throat> okay. All right. So, okay. So we're going to hop on our dragons <clears throat> and as we're flying through this portal, our frequency and our vibration is going to raise up. By the time we hit the portal, we're going to be in the light of God and divinely guided. Well, yeah, we've got to call in the crystal dimensional beings, the crystal programmers, higher vibrational crystal ray beings. Crystal skulls, galactic skulls. Okay. And 
against three golden dragons who just appeared. Three golden dragons. I don't know who they are, but you can just hop on one. Okay, I'm gonna hop on my perfect dragon here, and we're at we're at Earth level here, and we're gonna be flying into the astral. And we're gonna be going. Merlin's pointing to this portal. It has <clears throat> all these rainbow diamonds in it. Actually, it's white energy with all these rainbow diamonds everywhere in it. So we're gonna hop on our dragons and we're gonna fly towards that portal right now. Going up. As we're going towards this portal, we're, we're raising our vibration, going into the light of God, being divinely guided by source, by angelic source, being mm. through. And you go through the crystal, or into the crystal. Once you go through this portal, you'll be into the crystal dimension. It's just quick setting a quick intention. This is for the highest good of humanity. We're all going as one consciousness, coming back as one consciousness. Okay. And, uh, we are in the crystal, crystal city. The crystal city. Um, it's going to ask for Merlin to go in front here to guide us to where we have to go. And he is going into this, uh, what is that? It's crystalline energy, rainbow crystalline energy. It's like a, like a liquid light, like a crystalline energy. We're just going to go ahead and go to that energy. This is, I believe this is the energy. We're just walking to this big bubble of rainbow crystalline energy. It'll be very high frequency. <clears throat> this will be upgrading to some people. Um, uh, but you'll only be able to receive as much as you can take, so don't worry, you're not going to overdose of energy here. Okay, so we're in this sacred bubble of crystalline energy. And then Merlin is starting to draw out the circles already. Okay. <clears throat> okay, so we're going to tune into Giza, the pyramid, and we're going to draw the first circle with crystalline, this crystalline energy. All of us are creating in unison, drawing a circle around Giza with the rainbow crystalline energy. It is done. Yeah, and then we're gonna draw the second circle. And it's gonna overlap, so the Giza is right in the middle of the circles. And we're just gonna forge it now. So we're gonna forge this and these circles with this crystalline energy. Fire, fire magic. Holy fire. <clears throat> Diamond dimension, holy fire. Okay. So we're going to uh, call on this divine of programming the first circle we're going to send in divine feminine and masculine energies from our hearts it is creation energy it's not taken away from us it is just forging within this so I guess we'll have to forge it again the light language the light language afterwards okay <clears throat> okay so sending in divine feminine and masculine <laughs> Okay, so then we're going to send in unconditional love, our love to assist humanity, our hearts coming together as one, all hearts coming together as one. Crystal dim dimensional beings, the goddesses of the crystal dimension, mother goddess, mother goddess crystal being is here. She is magnificent. She's sending in her, her uh, blue, white light into our hearts. Uh, okay, uh, as we're sending in and receiving this blue, white light and this, this crystalline light, um, we are going to send it into the circles uh, unified as one with Sophia. Sophia is assisting divine feminine, Father God, divine masculine. All sending back in their hearts with us right now. Yeshua, Yeshua sending in Christ consciousness light into our hearts. 
Okay, and we're going to send this out for unconditional love to humanity, sending it now to the ring. She's got a light language name. Archangel Raphael, speak your words. Is that me? Yes. The eyes of all, the eyes of all, the eyes of all. It is alchemized. All the all the collective consciousness, the collective consciousness is aware they are watching. What? That's so odd. Okay. All right. Um, <clears throat> what else do we have to? We have water vibration raising. Okay. So we're going to call the crystal programmers in here to merge their hearts with us to send in the crystalline energies for raising the water vibrations throughout the planet. Pink. Water dragons assist. White gold. Pink, white gold. Pink, white gold. Okay. Sending it through. Mermaids, the wells, the dolphins, the starfish, the mermen, Loch Ness. Breathe it in. It is done. Okay, uh, inner child. Activations is la is this one here. Um, assistance. Okay, everybody now tune into their inner child, their inner child of love and play, that fun energy, and we'll connect our hearts, and we'll send that fun inner child, joy, playful energy into this ring to be the compass, to be the compass, compass activation. So, And this might activate just everybody who's here and watching as well, and that's fine too. It's, it's going to activate all of humanity at a collective level. They're actually somehow the collective consciousness is watching. I don't get it. it seems They're like their higher selves. Probably their higher selves. Their higher selves. No. Yes. Their higher selves. Blood, David. I connected the the center of the oh. the, the five Cs to the grid on the planet. Higher self, higher self collective is. Oh, sorry. Go ahead. What did you say, Adam? I connected the the center of the grid to the grid on the planet. Maybe that's why they can all see it. I could see like a, a spinning vortex connecting to the center. Yeah, we're getting some collective inner child energies channeling through us right now. So we're just. We're, we're I gonna think do- that vortex because my um, feet are moving like they're like jumping up and down and I'm like spinning in a circle. <laughs> yeah, I've been spinning, we're spinning we're it up. Onto it for sure. It's, I, it's Adam, fun. I know you're feeling this because <laughs> we get that sensation. <laughs> yeah, I was spinning it up from the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, been when like, David said fire, I saw water spinning. Dave, water. Yeah. I've, been, I've been told to connect to the uh, goddess of the underworld at the root of the tree of life. Okay, we, can we program the um, the other side first quickly? We got one more ring to program. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to um, send in DNA activations of all the star consciousness, all star systems, all constellations running through our DNA now, sending out through our hearts. For the highest and best good as your body can assimilate it to which DNA is necessitated to make you your highest and best self. Okay, all these Andromedans arise. They're all sending energy through us right now. It, it's actually called the energy DNA. It's the energy DNA we've lost. The heads of all constellations of all star systems are here with us, sending this energy through us. 
pretty hectic. <laughs> oh yeah, this one is hard to actually. Ugh. I'm actually Whoa. moving <laughs> the energy. <laughs> <laughs> send it into the ring send it into the ring <sighs> Lyran Volcans Seals Seals of the planet That's pretty crossing Seals of activation or whatever that means. Okay. Okay, uh, let's get the uh, ascension activation sending in all ascension activations for all chakra systems coming through our hearts now, all of our keys and our codes basically. We're sending in all of our keys of our codes for ascension. Opening up the infinity portal, linking this magic to it to go into all timelines. I feel the dimensions moving, joining. Hot, 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 hot. <sighs> okay, uh, magic, magic, Merlin's magic, all magic, fey magic, elemental magic, <laughs> all the magic of all time, magic of the sacred ancient books, all within our DNA, within our knowledge, <sighs> channeling that energy, sending it into the ring. <sighs> Grounding. So Corn dimension uh, assisting, crystal ray dimension assisting, collective rainbow energy coming in. Uh, sweat. Okay. I'm hearing it is done, it is done, it is done. Okay, unity and balance, unity and balance. Okay, so we're going to ask um, the Ascended Masters, Ascended Masters, past, present, and future, send it in through us the energies of unity and balance, rainbow, liquid light with Christ consciousness, with balance, balance assist with shadow work for the collective to assist with forgive allowing the collective to forgive themselves easier and to align to their highest good easier while being in balance with their life and in harmony and balance with their spiritual side send in these rays orange orange rays coming in mm. almost ready to go Adult. okay so we're going to collect that tree but i'm just going to connect to the sun and the crystal dimension connect to the solar the central sun the central sun next adam Ra joins his energy connect to the central sun next Bring an increased consciousness light and source light to power the centers. Lightning rays coming in. Oh. Mm. Pushing with the suns. <sighs> coming to light. Sending the light. Power in the circles. Coding. This light to stay in the, to power the second Pisces, <laughs> coding it to stay in. It cannot be removed. It cannot be removed. <sighs> when these rods using his green crystal, activate. <laughs> Thank you. <sighs> All right, it's blasting out the network. Um, okay, so the tree of life. Tree of life. All right. So let's. Okay. So hold on. This is because it's sending to infinity portals. Create a link through the infinity portals. Okay. Connect. Tree of life. Okay. So you're gonna go to the uh, 
the good part of the underworld to connect the tree of life with the Phil, is that what your plan is? Yeah, yeah. The goddess is that way, the underworld goddess. Okay. All right, we were just you. using golden roots, the Lumerian priestesses. They say to use that golden root again. It's already filled with love. Okay, so there's like a... Let's just go direct to this tree of life. Open up a golden light portal. We're going to come back here, I have a feeling. Okay, so let's go through the golden light portal. We're going to go to the good part of the underworld where the big mushrooms are. And there's no, there's, there is Fae as well. So we're just going to go yeah. right to the tree of life, completely protected. Reestablishing extra protections as we go through this golden light portal. We're going through and we're getting to the, we're, this automatic pass right to the tree of life here. The goddess on the other side. She's beside the tree on the other side of the tree, sitting down. Okay, she's standing up. Okay. You, how do you want us to tie this in? I hear she's thanking you and sending her blessings. I can see a, like a crystal egg, you know. Or some, or it's not a crystal, it's energy. Yeah. Rainbow energy. What do we, What happens to that? Um, I don't know. Something about this tree here is it's shooting out all this energy. It's actually <clears throat> this dimension seems a lot warmer than it usually does. It's like hot, like happier for some reason. Um, yeah, I see the tree is golden. Yeah, so we're it's emitting energy. Let's open up the tree here. Okay. So yeah, we- just for everyone, we've got me and Dave's got keys to open the port, uh, tree pod. Yeah. Okay. So how do you want us to do this? Yes, yeah, as do I. Thanks, Phil. You gave me a key. Root of Giza. <laughs> what does that mean? You know. I'll show you. Okay. So she's gonna guide us here. We're just gonna go ahead. And we're going to bring this energy from the tree of life up. We're going to fly it up here and go to it. It's like a satellite. Right up to underneath Giza here in the tunnels. Okay, we're activating. We're activating the, the, the heart of the Pisces from underneath the Giza. So we're connecting this energy here. This is going to be on the underside of our Viseca Pisces. So it's all connected. Okay. And now uh, we are going to go. Uh, connect with Christ. Con- connect with Christ consciousness, sacred heart. Yeah, it's, pow- it's powering from the sun. Sacred heart. You each, you each have the sacred heart spark. Okay. Now connect. let's all. Let's all go and stand in the second Pisces on the like like what is hovering right at the top of Giza. This energy is being activated right now. That will be conduits of all this energy we just programmed, sending it out to all the grid networks. I need to tell them to the grid. This is going to be very activating for a lot of people. Uh, the tone sends light. Most well, amazing rays are coming out in all directions. <sighs> I'm seeing the quantum effects. Consciousness is raising right now, big time from this. They're, they're asking me to tone again. Please bear with me. Oh, wow, that's so cool. The Andromedans and Syrians, they're all setting this light language codes down right now. Seeing the second place is being created sealing it all, all this energy so it will stay in and 
It's like these beams, these circle beams are coming down over the two circles from all the glasses. Everybody look up right now and see this white light coming from all the galactics shining over top of us right now. We're actually getting hit with these light language codes ourselves, so this is going to be activating super rapid. Pure white light language codes coming in. Transmission. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna follow this energy and we're gonna take it. We're just gonna create. Oh, I forgot to close up. I'm gonna close up. Okay. They they want you to pull it into your wiring. More coming. <sighs> Breathe it into your cellular DNA now, please. Light codes transmit. <sighs> transmit. Let's cut it from here. No. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I'm just going to send this through the crystal. And transmission. Sending all these codes to the infinity portal to seal all those of Psyche Pisces. So, everybody with intention, take this energy right now and with intention send it through the crystal dimension, to, through the infinity portal. It's a it's a it's like a rainbow portal. It's open in the crystal dimension, and uh, it's going to all timelines and realities. It's going to seal their Fasega Pisces over their Gizas, connecting to all their grids as well. I'm literally sweating buckets. Okay, <laughs> uh, this is intense. Okay, so where else do we got to do? And energy is moving. Stars. Stars. Okay. We're going to merge with all the star systems. We're going to merge with all the suns. And we're all going to merge with this light right now. Becoming the sun, becoming the stars, becoming this light. And sending it through all to the infinity portals. Sending all star codes all codes of ascension I'm sending this through to all realities and all timelines for all realities to ascend to assist all realities with the great awakening The ancestors send their blessing to the land. <clears throat> New stars are being created. So weird. Okay. Your ancestors are in the stars. Yeah, it's like they're creating more stars. Right. I think they're creating more stars to mark this day, actually. Day. This is a lot of light. This is a whole lot of light. Okay, so let's take a step back. All right, so there's 
ancient symbols through all this as well. Oh yeah, it's all connected. They're having me uh, draw the infinity symbol. Yeah, it's beautiful. Actually, this is, it's all beautiful. It's worked. It's perfect. There's this amazing light coming at the top of Giza now and it's shooting in all these directions. And, and still? Uh, uh, are you, uh, are you yes. supposed to do a chapter from the book of Merlin, the purple one? I've just done mine. You don't have to speak it loud. Chia Chinua Sia Kula Chia Sia Chua Sia Cha Sia Cha Ula Ula Cha Ula Cha Ushka Ushka I unjet the Koyama I the Kong Ushed Apakawera na Kushed Ushed Apashuara Aiki Kushed worlds <sighs> sending this to the inner worlds for some okay inner worlds connecting to Gaia connecting to Gaia this energy will assist many of the inner world realities okay sending in connecting it do you want me to do you want us to connect it all right we're all gonna connect this energy the to the inner worlds, sending it into the heart of Gaia, and then she's going to disperse it into all the inner world realities. <sighs> They're reminding me that I have galactic Reiki in my hands and to transmit it, so they're actually shaking my hands. <laughs> it's kind of amusing. <laughs> She's saying to send it all out, channel, breathe this energy in that we're in, send it all out, breathe through the souls of your feet, all into Gaia, channel it, send it all to the heart of Gaia, she's going to take it to the inner world. <laughs> yeah, I was raising, raising, raising. <laughs> it's making me laugh. <laughs> well, if you want more? I can do more. <laughs> right. She's got it. She's got it. Okay, I think that's absolutely fabulous. I'm pretty sure <sighs> this is a lot of energy. So let's go to Stonehenge. Uh, so I'm going to open up a portal here, the pink portal, and we're just going to go right through the pink portal. And all are through, we'll close it, we'll just go to Stonehenge. And then everybody <laughs> put their hands in the center of Stonehenge, connect this light into all sacred sites and all dimensional planes and realities. <sighs> All chakras of Gaia, her earthly chakras, yeah. are cleansing, cleansing, cleansing. Open. Blocks are open. Okay. Uh, Adam, Adam. Archangel Michael, they are asking you to check and bless. They used the sword of Archangel Michael and, and passed the blessing. Do the blessing like we did for the kingdoms. Tell me when you're done. Tell us. But you're going to put the sword in the portal. Staff right in it. Okay, I'm done. And 
now they're saying water energy to clear, wash away. Holy water. Raphael, healing, please. Yeah. I'm just reading from the book of the Merlin. Quantum field's getting upgraded right now. Some of these uh, ancient sites have had some dark, dark past as well. They're not yeah. always a bad light. They're not always a bad light. Do we yeah, need to clear that? Yeah, Phil, Phil, yeah. Can, Phil can cleanse that. And you can just use yeah. a spell. We can send in, just send in your unconditional love to Phil, and then he'll he'll send it all through. Okay, sending now, everyone. I see your crystal bean. She's sending you light right now. Mm -hmm. All collectives are here, the fake collectives. They're pushing this light out as well. Transmuted now, though. all the remnants of the dark magic everywhere. It's still an edge of connections to Orion. Didn't know that. Uh, anybody else feeling that racing of the heart? It's that clearing. That's that clearing. Yeah, some people might be um, um, getting majorly upgraded right now. I've been watching this and it's totally fine. I was when I first started. This is very activating. Expect homing in the morning. Yeah. What'd you say? Homing <laughs> in the head. You're there. Homing in the head. Great. I think we're good. So I'm just going to create a white portal here and it's going to take us right to our houses. I'm just going to go through it. I'm going to go pink ones close now. And then when all are through, just come back to um, kill. There's a few more people coming through. I'm going to take a golden squeegee over everybody's heads now, and their houses, and their heads, and this golden squeegee is going to clear your house, pushing anything dense or foreign that could have possibly, even if it didn't come from this, it's, it's getting pushed, and it's going to go into Gaia, going over your head now, golden squeegee, neck, arms, shoulders, solar plex area, legs, feet, pushing anything foreign or dense out into Gaia, sending it to Gaia. Okay. Clear. Clear. There's one who's going to watch in the future. There's one who's going to watch in the future. He, he had an attachment before. Help him clear it. Okay. hearing all clear yeah no sending a source it's somebody who's watching in the future they had an attachment okay. it wasn't related to this but they had an attachment they just wanted us to clear it. okay so if somebody watching in the future is going to feel like oh my god i feel so great now okay all right all right so yeah then just um so when you're done uh open your eyes with your hands with your toes do your makeup 